I'm not a vampire, not an alien, I'm not the fucking mummy, I'm a goblin. Greetings, Goblin Nation! Welcome to a review, a long review of Planet Coaster. Oh yeah, and from game review. Did I mention it's a game? And isn't this game? You have your own attractions you can build. You kind of uh, have a kind of. But the attractions are a little bit. You can edit the attractions. Some uh, some attractions you can edit. That's like, I, I, if I have to compare it to anything, it would be uh, uh, ro uh, roller coaster type. Tycoon 2. That's like the game I played. Like the second one I played. I played also the first, but the second one was like the one I played so much. But the third one was like, oh, that's that. That's not the same. That's not kind of thing. And even Planet uh, Planet Coaster feels like not kind. Of, I felt like the best version of uh, the Planet Tycoon kind of uh, kind of game was uh, uh, Pl uh, Planet Tycoon 2. Even though the graphics were okay, very minimal, and in this game it's much more cooler but you could have the path could be better you have this uh, great path you can hear somehow I cannot make this whole kind of situation I cannot make this whole plane kind of thing I cannot make either a whole kind of thing to put stuff on some stuff don't turn as they uh, they should some other stuff are like very hard to turn kind of thing and yes sometimes you have to like uh, if you want to turn you have to control then go into th that kind of other systems while well, it was way more easier uh, to do all that stuff in pl uh, in uh, tycoon 2 like in uh, coaster tycoon 2 was way more way more better to do you could make your own coasters way way easier uh, i feel like that game was like the best version of it. If we can ever a remaster of a Tycoon game, it has to be plan uh, uh, the two, second version. Because uh, Planet Coaster has like a DLC, it uh, has great DLC, don't get me wrong, it's this kind of thing. But it also has this like, you can edit your stuff, but you have to first able to play it, and then that doesn't always work. You don't have that big stuff sometimes, so even though you have like kind of thing, you have uh, coasters, there are some coasters that are done and there are some cool special coasters that you would not find in kind of thing. And certainly with the DLC you can have this stat and what really rocks and there is really fun stuff and you can even go first person. What I always want, I always wanted that in a coaster. Uh, that's one of the things I really wanted for uh, for Ty because I'm able to see, able to uh, see first person. And in this game you can do that. You can test it out, you can kind of thing, you can see that everything works. You can have, the, uh, and like there's so much building and then you have to uh, also manage your kind of thing. and. Ma I manage everything and yes I'm terrible at the manage so I'm playing mostly sandbox kind of thing uh, but there is also like you can have this world I'm uh, mine world is called Goblins Wonderland welcome my friends but it also feels like still there's not much to it uh, sure there's a, like lots of DLC lots of kind of thing but how to create a pet sometimes kind of thing and to create a, like a larger kind of thing is a little bit harder than it should be kind of thing I feel like you should just add it in one street and sometimes the street kind of thing goes a little bit however you cannot make them both uh, sometimes it also goes a little bit to the right uh, kind of thing sometimes it's a little bit harder to close it to uh, the thing sometimes it goes really a uh, kind of thing there are some issues that i got with planet coaster that i'm like that f makes me feel going a little bit off i like the thing because i'm right now i'm like on youtube videos from uh, kind of, uh, from uh, disney world from things what how that uh, begin i've been watching those panic uh, final videos like how it begin, how what the first coaster was, what kind of thing, what are the best coasters, what uh, what issues had some coasters, how they rework some coasters, how some coasters failed, and they have to uh, what happened with the coasters? Did they just abandon? It? Because some things get abandoned, kind of thing. So sometimes in like the future, ten years from that at that point, it gets rebuilt or kind of gets some uh, uh, gets destroyed. There was the, like the world's biggest, uh, biggest, uh, big, even bigger than Disneyland kind of thing. Uh, where Disneyland was not that big kind of thing. And I was like, that is like, that's interesting. So interesting, I wanted to make my own kind of thing. I wanted and I did in Planet Coaster. But it also feels like, okay, this is fun. Right now I'm having fun. But I also feel like, how long am I going to have fun with this day? Uh, well, I played already six hours of it. So... 
I'm gonna be saying in a couple days I maybe get bored of this game already, but it's for it was ten bucks on Steam. Say, ah, I'm like, okay, if I'm gonna pay, if I, I really want to do this for some kind of reason, I'm not a perfect guy for wanna go in a coaster, but Dark Rides I like. I love Dark Rides, like looking in the kind of thing, looking in the front, it's the beautiful kind of thing. And I'll try to do this also in this game, trying to make this uh, everything a little bit cooler. But there is not that much uh, kind of thing going on. There are some animatronics that you can, like dragons having kind of, I have like a, a piece that is all about dragon. You can have this futuristic kind of thing, aliens, everything. But also it feels like there's not enough. There is, even with all the DLC, that there is out there. I still think it's not enough. The Planet Coaster should be been like here is studio, here is the kind of thing, here is some free updates because this game has been out a long time. Feels like it should have met more. I felt like also a Tycoon kind of thing, uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 is like the best because it has more kind of thing. You can make your own coasters very easy. While in this one it feels like a little bit hard because first you have to place a normal coaster, then you can edit the coaster and some kind of thing. Um, and also it's not always easy. That feels like very like I want to play this kind of game but it feels like it's, it's not so accessible as the other game was also that one I played like it was the Sims for the Sims 1 and 2 uh, so Then there was of the PC uh, Counter-Strike Source and then there was Tycoon kind of 2 that I played a lot So those things I played a lot kind of thing. So yes, it could be like uh, there is no better game than that that I always gonna prepare to this while there is some cool games about it while well, this isn't cool game in general I feel like and there are some cool attractions in it that you can play some attraction you would not get anywhere else uh, it feels like it's not enough it just it's not enough to make me feel like this is gonna be a game I'm gonna play for years like I played that other coaster I played and sure that kind of also is like on grass course because I didn't have that many games I had some PlayStation 2 games a piece of 100 PlayStation 2 games I had four PC games that was about it I, I say as I, I'm just realizing I said 200 because I did have a lot of games on PlayStation but on PC I, I didn't have so many I had Sims, I had Counter Strike, and those were actually the big games that I've really played to death because now I don't play them anymore because I played a lot of them. Maybe that's also maybe one of the reasons I don't uh, like this Planet Coast because I played the Tycoon version to death because GTA 5, I also like, I played a lot of GTA when I was a teenager. I played a lot of that kind of thing. I played and GTA, I played a lot even when 5 came out, I played a lot in the beginning. It's like I played a lot of those kind of games. So now those kind of games don't interest me right now as much as they sh uh, they did when I was kind of playing. And also there's more games out there, is more kind of thing. And I'm more into TV shows, movies right now than I'm like you know what, maybe right now, not a really great time for it, I don't know what I'm meaning. Anyway, that's just my opinion about uh, Planet Coaster kind of thing, so I give it a 7 out of 10. I don't uh, say comforting, because I don't see me playing, I keep on playing this, but it's like something fun to do while I, when you're bored and don't have like not enough time to play a story game and the kind of thing you want to do something different than your usual game shooter or fighting game kind of thing and Planet Coaster, yeah, right, it's the right kind of game. Uh, so yes, what do you guys think? Do you guys like Planet Coaster? You guys are like, hey, that Planet Coaster is actually a good game. I played like 20 hours on it. How can you get bored of that? Let me know your opinion. And down below, I am this twisted goblin. And to my goblin nation, I say goodbye and good night. Then the days got worse and worse, and now you see I've gone completely out of my mind.